Hi guys! Alright, so I'm going to be showing you how to access SPSS and how to log into UCF apps. And then I'll show you as well how to uh, find mean, median, mode, and uh, variance on SPSS as well. So first what you want to do is you want to come to UCF apps, UCF login. It's going to take you here. It's gonna, I already logged in, it's gonna ask you to log in. You just use your UCF uh, email and password. And then you're gonna, this is my, obviously my most recent app, but you would just go here to apps, all apps. Scroll down to IMB SPSS Statistics 25. Open. Launch it. And the computer that I'm using right now is a HP Pavilion. It's a little bit of an older computer, so you have to give it some time to load. Perfect. Now it's going to take you here. What you want to do is you want to hit New Data Set. Open. And that'll take you here to a new data set. Now I've already set up one, so I'm going to go ahead and close these out. So what I did is the test group one, and these are just some test scores that I plugged in. And then I came to the second variation, did it here as well, different set of numbers. And over here you have a data view and a variable view. Now the data view is gonna, where you're gonna see, where you're gonna put, input all of your numbers and information. Variable view is you can see all these things here. You can change the name of the groups. You would just come to the name and type in a different group. Now what you're gonna wanna do now is hit Analyze, Descriptive Statistics, Frequencies. We don't want, depending on the assignment, what I'm showing you right now, we don't want the frequency table, but that depends on the assignment. You want to go to Statistics, Mean, Median, Mode, Standard Deviation, Variance. That's what I want to show for mine. So I'm going to hit Continue. Now I'm going to highlight these and put them over here into our variables. I'm going to hit OK. Now it's going to calculate. And here we go. I have my test group here, 1, test group 2. The number of numbers, our means for both, medians for both, modes for both, standard deviation for both, and our variance for both. Now, to save normally, you would just save it as this save as and all that stuff, but most assignments are going to have you save it as a JPEG, and this program doesn't let you save it as a JPEG, so what you want to do is you want to copy the image, and once you do that, you want to go over to a Word document, which I guess I should have opened beforehand. <laughs> All right, so I made a cut in the video because it was taking way too long to open Word. Finally got it open. So basically, after you've copied the image from SPSS, the, the output, you're just gonna come here to Word, keep source formatting, and paste. And then there you go. Then you'll file, save as. and then you'll save it from here. A docs or a JPEG is how you want to save it. And then yeah, that's how you're going to do that.